Okay, welcome back everyone. Look at my Kalamundan. The last time when I first bought it, it was so tiny. The fruit was so tiny. It just, uh, the flower was just uh, blooming. So it had a little baby tiny fruit. But now look at how big it became. I haven't been taking care of it, but it's still fruity. It's still grown big and I did put some um, uh, fertilizer in it and watch it grow so it's growing big and healthy let it turn around spin around these are my babies my new baby boomers so I didn't steal it from nobody but I bought it for $40 look how big it is now look at the fruits it's Kalamundans Look how cute and beautiful, precious they are. There you go. So, right now I am, I just woke up, so I don't have my makeup on like always. And, but I'm visiting my little babies back here. So, um, I'm letting it sunbathe. So, it got, it had the first frost already. So, uh, this morning was freezing, last night was freezing, and, yep, when I move to Arkansas, then I'm going to leave all this behind, I'll donate it to somebody, so, I just want to see how good it is that I'm going to grow these papayas, so, this one hasn't fruit yet, so, it might be a male, and these, I don't know if this will be a male or female, I can't tell, I think, uh, I have to wait a little longer, and so is that one. So they're both growing tall, but um, like there, there go my other plants. So I have trimmed these already. These are basil right here, so they're pretty healthy. But I got to trim more so all the bad leaves go away. And then I don't remember what this is avocado. <laughs> So I planted in these things and, you know, these um, styrofoam cups, but, uh, not cups, but styrofoam um, containers, but they ha they didn't grow too big. So look at these. These are Kalamundan. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11 so all these are Kalamundans so I'm just experimenting but I might donate it before I move to Arkansas so as a gift mm, my coconut didn't grow at all so I don't know why but I didn't cover it up completely I guess but my eggplants I gotta get rid of because oh look I see eggplants flower right there so I don't know um, let's see one more round and then I'll get rid of this eggplant Wow I wonder what this is it kind of dried up and died and then it grew right back so it's grown healthy and I have no clue what this, <laughs> this is let me see it's either a lime or a grapefruit I don't know I have plants so I don't even have a clue what what it is see this one right here is mummy sapote so that's my mango for four or five years now I need to plant it in a bigger pot or plant it into the ground or something those are my two papaya my water spinach garden I have to redo it before I have companies come over in, um, in two months. So I gotta redo this whole entire garden again. That's my water spinach, it needs water. And then here go more Kalamundan, more Kalamundan, more Kalamundan, more Kalamundan, more Kalamundan. I have so much and so many Kalamundans. But this year, here go another Kalamundan. I gotta throw all these away, restart. My papaya, no, my um, avocado didn't work out. So those are my pomelos, but it didn't grow at all. So I'm gonna throw 
a lot of stuff out, clean it out. Today's my day off, so I need to start working on my garden again and redo my garden and make sure at least we have something to eat better than nothing to eat. So when companies come over, but I'm about to move, so I don't know if I should even start my garden again. But um, like I said, whatever happens, happens. Look at this. This right here. It died. Look at the root. It looked like it's dying, but it grew out healthy, a new stem right there. So look how healthy it is. I have no clue what I grew. Either a tangerine, a lemon, and let's check my lime. Oh, wow. Look how tall my lime tree is. Look how tall it is. How big it, my plant is. That's my persimmon, no, uh, not persimmon, uh, Persian lime. I bought it at Home Depot. Yep, I love plants. I love growing food. But it has a fruit. Oh my god, look at this. I found a flower. I found another one right underneath it. One, one flower, two flower. Let's see. Oh, look, more right here. Three, four, five, six. So, oh my God! Look, look! I found the babies, baby uh, limes, right there. Hopefully, it'll um, it'll bloom and successfully survive. So, there go more, more baby limes right there. See, right there. There go one, two. Wow. Oh. We're going to have limes so we don't have to buy no more limes. Saving a lot of money, but I use God's water, God's rainwater, and God's and Mother Nature's um, magic. Her, her uh, what is it, a cold front comes in. It needs that little frost, and God is helping me. God is feeding me. And God is taking care of me. So, I'm so happy. I'm so excited. I bought this plant for... I don't remember how much I bought it for. Uh, but... I don't remember. How much did I buy it for? Here it is. Oh, I don't see the price on here. I don't remember how much. See? Persian lime bought it but I don't remember how much I bought it for $80 I think I bought it for $80 it was a pretty expensive one but 80 or 175 I forgot how much it was the price of it so let's see wait wait a minute I don't recall did I buy this heavy stuff I, I thought I bought it in a little container and I brought it home and then they transplant it but how did they keep oh he took the label off and <laughs> taped it on that's why I, I don't remember buying this big huge container I couldn't take it home all by myself but I remember I bought a small one like I bought the pot about this size so it's uh, not too heavy to carry home and then all of the fruits that I buy home they are fruiting the happy babies. These are baby boomers that I was talking to people about on my ads on Houston Press. This is a baby boomers. So the male flower and the female flowers, they can go pollinate and make lots of baby go wherever they want, wherever their pollens flies to. So I have to put uh, a bunch of pollens next to each other so that when the wind blows it automatically fertilized so I wouldn't have to do much but I'm so happy we have limes now